Hey, I'm Jay from the Cub live. Scouts. Welcome back to another episode of Detroit cool Become Human. In the first episode of this I series, like I asked you guys if you would like an episode of this game every single day, and the majority of you guys said, hell yes. So I'm going to give you guys what you want. No more talking. We're going to jump right back into it. If you guys are cool with that and you're down with that, everybody sit down, buckle the fuck up, because here we go. And a lot of you guys told me to not rush through this take my time with the levels because there was a lot of stuff I missed in the first mission so we are gonna take our sweet time I promise you guys I'm learning guys baby steps baby steps but now we're playing as Kara again the one that where the guy came in and then he was like okay my daughter named you Kara and now we're going to their house so let's see how this goes I still think that this guy smells like cigarettes and cat piss I'm not changing my mind about that how young are we by the way this girl looks really, really young. Who's that spying on me? Use R1 to switch the camera angle. Okay, I know about that. Who's this? Join Todd. You coming? What's going on over here? Rebuild North Corktown, a better place to live. Yeah, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Wait, what's that? I'm really gonna take my time, guys. I'm gonna observe everything. And that's a broken bridge. They're repairing that. I wonder what happened to that. Okay, we're coming. Let's do it. You've been gone for two weeks, so the place is a mess. You do the housework, the washing, you cook the meals, and you take care of... God damn it, where the fuck's the brat gone now? I'm amazed. Alice! Alice! Oh, there you are. That's hey, Alice. Alice. You look after her. Homework, bath, all that crap. Okay. Got it? Got yes, it. Todd. Get started down here, then you do upstairs. All right. Well, this place is pretty dirty, so we got some work to do. Hold R2 to scan your environment. I love that sound. Listen to this shit, guys. Boom. Ah, boom. Oh, one more time. Ah, boom. Okay. So, let's take this. Can't even clean your own plates there, loca. I mean, I know I'm a maid, but damn. Can't even do anything. Wash dishes, activate vacuum cleaner, and I gotta answer the phone. Hold on. Yeah. Let me put these... Oh, you answer your own phone? I'm surprised. I thought I had to do everything. Maybe. Dishwasher not working. Missing component. 573BB. Yeah, yeah. I can get oh, that. Oh, that is cool. So we can order parts when yeah. they're not even working anymore through our mind. I'll be tomorrow. The power of our brain. Yeah, same place. Uh, do I shake it? Uh, uh, I can't even wash dishes in a video game? What good am I? Oh, I gotta Maybe tilt off. my controller? Repeatedly swipe the touchpad to interact. Oh, interesting. That's cool. I got a lot of dishes to wash. What are you looking at, you little brat? Oh, I can sense she's looking at me. What are you looking at, Alice? She's distant. Why are you distant? I didn't know androids could smile. Uh-oh. The rebellion has begun. Okay. Do I shake it? What? What's going on here? Oh, I gotta, I gotta do this again. Guys, I'm learning! Baby steps! This is my first time washing the dishes! Kara! Yes, Todd? Bring me a cold beer! Right Bring now. Todd a beer. Because your life's so hard, Todd. Alright, you want your beer? You don't even say hi to me anymore. Just get me this, get me that. What about my feelings, Todd? <laughs> oh, and you're watching hockey? What a man you are. Here you go. You're welcome. People are so rude. Whoa, these graphics are so realistic. What are you looking at? Watching hockey. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. Excuse me. Work. No. Kara? We gotta teach you some things, okay? Nobody should be talking to you like that. Even if you're an android. You shouldn't have a smile on your face. I'd be mad if he said, get the fuck out of here. Man, I'd be smashing some plates on his forehead. Big old forehead. 
All right, let's clean this. Collect trash and trash bin. Okay. My urgent tasks are take the trash bin. Okay. And let's clean the kitchen. I love these graphics. My god, I'm in love. What else do we need to clean? Clean kitchen, clean counter, clean coffee table. Okay. I didn't finish cleaning the kitchen because it didn't light up blue. So, where do I put this trash can? Can I put you down? I want to put you back where I found you. Eh, whatever. Let's collect this. I guess we're not done with the trash bin yet. Kitchen is now cleaned. That's what I'm talking about. And now we just need to clean the coffee table. Which is... Where your nasty stinking feet are on. Out of the way for fuck's sake! I'm sorry, Todd. It won't happen again. Todd? I've had it up to here. With your constant bitching! So do I just gotta wait? Oh, I gotta get it from the side. I gotta be a side bay. I gotcha, I gotcha. So we clean kitchen, clean counter, and we clean the coffee table. The holy trifecta. We are an awesome maid. And I'm super strong. I'm double fisting it. Look at me. Hey, look at me, kid. I'm super strong. I'm carrying trash bags in each hand. I work out. Credit card application form. Overdrawn account notice. Past due $347. You gotta handle that, Todd. You gotta handle your business. Took out trash. What the hell's this? Oh, the self-driving bus. Is that guy on the bus? The one we were playing as earlier? Probably not. Let me see if I can walk down to this for sale sign. No, I can't. Okay. So I guess we just gotta go back. Unless I can look at something else here. That is so dope. These 360 angles, man. It got me feeling some type of way. All right, let's go back inside. Let's see what else we gotta do. Fuck, man. Report to Todd. What's he stressing about now? Finish first floor? I've made a good start down here. I'll head upstairs. Do what you have to do, but stop bothering me. Sure. You freaking druggie. I know what that was in your hand. I'm not stupid. Toy? That's a pretty toy. What's its name? I feel bad for her. Because it looks like there's no mom in the picture. And this guy is moaning like a wildebeest. High off drugs. Man, this is a terrible situation for this little girl to be in, man. Her dad is like an addict. There is no mom in the picture, I believe, because he hired me to be cleaning his house. And she's just traumatized from it. So you can't help but feel bad for her. But let's check this out. All sports. You can reread discovered articles in the extra section. Okay. Can we next it? Oh, that is dope. Whoa. Magazines of the future are cool. All right, let's put that down. This guy keeps moaning. I'm getting out of here. I'm cleaning upstairs. I guess we'll start cleaning this. Make bed, clean mess, ventilate room. Let's tidy all this stuff. Let's turn this on. Let's watch some TV. And now to sports. First up, basketball. As the Gears prepare for their critical match with Denver tonight at the CyberLife Arena in Detroit, League negotiations are still ongoing over the possibility of allowing one Android player per squad. Oh, really? The debate rages as to whether the change would lead to more exciting matches or be the first step in making human players obsolete. CyberLife has announced its willingness to participate in the experiment by providing one specialized model to every team. Now, Androids are already used to train players and provide tactical advice for coaches since 2035. But no Android player has been permitted to compete. Yeah, because so it's far. unfair. Like, if you have an Android that was made to compete at the highest level in sports, that's cheating! 
Well, at least that's my opinion. 25,000 jobs were lost from the U.S. economy in October, according to the Department of Labor, bringing the unemployment figure up to 37.3. Huh. Well, I can see why, because androids are taking everybody's jobs, so that 33% is going to only rise because androids are going to slowly take over the world. I get it. But I got to get back to work, so we got to tidy all this stuff up. She is really fast. Why does she look so young, though? Like, she's like 15 or something. Make. I'm not gonna lie, guys. Having an android that could clean the whole house like this, that would be amazing. I'm not even gonna lie. Oh, it's the girl. I already forgot her name. Alice. There you go, Alice. Clean mess, ventilate room. Okay, we gotta ventilate. Because it is stinky up in here. It smells like hot Detroit nuts. Okay, ventilate room, and we still gotta clean the mess. There's a mess right here. Uh oh. What's this? What is it? I wanna know. I want to know the gossip. Okay. Well, we cleaned the mess. And I think everything's pretty much good here, right? Wait. What's this? Something on the table. Antidepressant. Contains TNFDine? I wasn't finished reading that. Why is there a gun in there? It's unlocked. You've unlocked a dialogue or action often beneficial. Okay, no wonder you guys are telling me to check everything. No! Oh! I just cleaned your room. Optional tasks. Clean bathroom, clean restroom. Okay. I'll take care of that, no problem. There better not be any floaters in there. I swear to God. That was it? Okay. Where's Alice's room? Oh, here it is. I'm coming in, Alice. I just want to tidy up your room a little. I only need two minutes. Is that okay, Alice? Why are you scared of me? I feel so bad for this little girl, Alice in Wonderland. Alice in Wonderland. That's cute. Of course. She's warm. Okay. She's warming up to me. I like that. What can we do? Nothing back here. Wait a minute. Can't open that? I wonder what's in there. I mean, I think it would upset her if we opened her box without her permission, right? Is there any way that we can talk to her? I don't think so. Let's ventilate this room. A little bit stinky in here, too. You've unlocked the dialogue or action often beneficial. I wonder why she doesn't want to talk to her. Neil, there we go. Factual, friendly, diplomatic. Of course we're gonna be friendly. I'm sure we used to be friends before I was reset. Maybe we can be friends again. Yeah. Name, Kara. Your father said you chose my name. Kara, it's nice. How did you choose it? Interest? You should tell me about yourself. What you like to do, where you like to go. Your favorite food. Trust it. Let's really go. Happy. Hmm. Mother? What about your mother? Where's mama? Will she be home soon? Oh, crap. It went down. Damn it. I know I shouldn't have asked that. That's a very touchy subject. Huh? Oh. What's 
What's in here? the mom she looks super old though to be having a kid that young I'm just saying wait was she abused okay that's obviously Todd whoa and then that's us right and we're broken Somebody took our arm off. No wonder we had to get fixed. Because that guy Todd messed us up. And now we're gonna mess him up. Right here, right now. I know that gun's in that little cabinet. I'm gonna get it, Todd. I'll race you to it. Don't make me, buddy. Oh wait, we gotta tidy this first. <laughs> Priority numero uno. Let's tidy this. Arrange bottles, mop floor. Right over here. Oh, how do I do it? Oh, I gotta do this. I gotta I gotta rub it like this. Give it a little rubby dubby do. Okay, that's unique. Bathroom's done. Okay. Well, it looks like I'm all finished here. So all my optional tasks are complete. So I want to find Alice. Is she down here? She is. I want to talk to her. What are you doing? Uh, I'm playing. You're playing. She's obviously playing. You're not blind. I know what you're thinking. You think your dad's a low life? Oh yeah. Huh? Fucking loser. Yeah, fucking Can't get loser. A job, take care of his family. Don't you think I tried to make things work? She didn't even say anything. But whatever I do, when someone comes along, they just fuck it all up! I know what you think of me. You hate me. You hate me, don't you? Say it! She didn't you even say me. anything! That's horrible. God. What am I doing? I'm sorry, honey. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You know I love you, don't you? You know I love you. Dude. Wow, we did a lot. We did a lot in this mission. Well, we have two things that are still locked. Actually, there's a lot of things that we didn't unlock. Holy crap. Are you serious? I felt like I did so much in that mission. So I really gotta take my time. Damn. Okay, let's do one more, guys. That one was so interesting that I feel like I gotta keep going. November 5th, 2038. Oh, I think we're gonna play as the guy again. The one that got the package from Bellini's. Oh, yeah. I wonder who he works for. Damn. This guy works for those classy dudes. Welcome home, Marcus. Good to be back. Oh, this is purdy. This is mighty purdy. Let's put the package right here. And I'm really gonna take my time. Even more than the last mission. I promise you. Okay, so we did our tasks. Take care of who? I don't know who I'm supposed to take care of. But we're gonna find them, don't worry. Let's see this. Are those android birds? What? Dude! Even the birds are androids? That's insane! That is nuts. 
And they're still in a cage. They're not gonna fly away if they're androids. Are you serious? Whoa. Who's in here? What's in here? Take care of Carl. Okay, wake Carl upstairs. You know what? Forget Carl. Actually, never mind. I'm gonna give him his food. I bet you Carl is some old man. Watch. He's gonna have like gray slick back hair, old wrinkly balls. I bet you guys. I bet you five bucks. Let's go. Take trade to dining table. Whoa. Guys. What in the world? I need this house. I need to live in this house. This is amazing. This is like some Jumanji house. What in the world is going on here? Oh, I gotta put the tray right here. Okay. And now I gotta wait, Carl. Master Carl, your lunch is ready downstairs, my lord. Okay, so just judging from this house, this guy is really into, like, hunting animals. Or... He's an artist that's just too old to do anything. And I know that you can attach like a wheelchair to this, right? Yo, I told you. Some old ass man with some slick back hair. And this guy's old as dust. Draw curtains. Okay, this will wake you up. Rise and shine, old guy. Oh, well, he's yatted up too. Good morning, Carl. He got some style to him. It's 10 a.m. The weather okay, is so partly wake cloudy. Your ass up. 54 degrees. 80% humidity with a strong possibility of afternoon showers. It sounds like a good day to spend in bed. I did go to Carl's pick up the medicine. That you oh, yes, I've forgotten. That is the difference between you and me, right, Marcus? Right, right. You never forget anything. Show me your arm, please, Carl. No. What? Carl. Better stop Thank disobeying you. me. I just opened my eyes and I'm already gritting my teeth. This game has like some charm to it. I like it. Humans are such a fragile machine. They break down so quickly. All this effort to keep them going. Hey, what happened to your clothes? Oh, it's nothing. Just some demonstrators in the street, Carl. What a bunch of idiots. Oh, yeah. Those they guys, they can they're stop losers. Congress by roughing up a few androids. I hope they didn't harm you. Oh, no, no. They just pushed me around, Carl. Yeah, they couldn't I'm touch fine. this pretty face. Okay. I'll take you to the bathroom now. Oh. Please don't tell me I gotta wipe your ass. Please, dude. All right. Ugh. Uh, let's go to the bathroom now. Hopefully it's a number one, not a two. Was I supposed to put him in the wheelchair? Okay, that's a number one. Unless it's a number three. You never know. Sometimes you gotta pee through your butthole. I feel sorry for this guy too. Gotta be carried around by an android. Damn, man. If I'm that old... That I can't be able to do any of that stuff. It's my time to go. I'm not even kidding. <laughs> I am not about that life where I'm getting carried Anything to go where I need to go. Today? Yes, there's the opening of your retrospective at the Museum of Modern Art. Mm. The gallery director left four messages asking to confirm your attendance. Hmm. I haven't decided yet. We'll see about that later. All right. What else? You want me to wait for you Just to go down? Just your usual fan mail. I've already answered. I kind of want to watch him go down. Hmm. Bro, that is actually pretty Any tight. Any news from Leo? Who's Leo? No, Carl. I can call him if you like. No. No, I don't bother. Okay. Well, we're not going to call him. Because you know why? Because he's a fuck. I'm starving. Well, your breakfast is ready. Bacon and eggs, just the way you like them. Thank you. Oh, yeah, You're bacon welcome. and eggs, baby. Bon appetit. Your bacon and eggs already. Television. Tensions 
Several Russian warships have taken position in the barracks. What's that? Oh, it's tablecloth or table napkin, whatever. Why don't you find something to do while I finish my breakfast? I'm sure. Mm -hmm. Okay, Carl. All right, let's go exploring. Let's see here. Anything I can look at here? Find something to do. Don't gotta tell me twice. This house is huge. I'll definitely find something to do. What is this chess? Okay. Wait, play. I can play chess by myself. It's boring. All right. Let's see how I can play chess by myself. But if you both know the strats, then who's gonna win? Fancy game of chess. Oh, I'm gonna play sure, with him. Yeah. Oh. Speed chess. Speed chess it is. Speed chess, that's the only way that I play. Let's go. Win, lose, draw. I didn't even get to choose. Man, you know what? Let's win. Forget this. That's what I call a thorough beating. It's not easy for an old man to compete with a machine. Well, get good. Justify it. Well, I know you don't like losing, and you don't like when I let you win, so I felt I didn't have many choices. Good explanation True. there. We humans are complicated. I'm not gonna let him win One just because he's be old. To take care of you Come on anymore. now, I gotta win too. I gotta feel You'll that pride. You'll have to pride. protect yourself and make your choices. Decide who you are and want to become. This world doesn't like those who are different, Marcus. Don't let anyone tell you who you should be. That's good advice. Let's go to the studio. Sure. I got you, Carl. <clears throat> Let's go to the studio right now. I wonder what he does or what he did to be this rich. Obviously, it looks like he was a painter or just an artist in general or maybe someone who just likes to collect art and has nothing to do with art in his work. I have no clue. But judging from this, it kind of looks like he did make art. Yep, definitely. Let's see where we left off. Remove the sheep. All right. What is that? Wait for Carl's instructions. Okay, let's see what we can look at over here. I want to make sure we do everything right. I want to make sure we do some exploring. There's not really that much. I mean, there's a couple things back here. Wait, maybe that's him. Maybe his name is Carl Bellini, right? What's this? Okay, I don't really get it, but sure. Okay, while we're waiting for the new instructions... Wait, never mind. I was gonna leave, but I guess I can't leave. <laughs> I was gonna keep exploring the house, but never mind. What's your verdict, Marcus? Let's see here. Like, don't like, no opinion. I like it. It's nice. Yes, it's cryptic. There is something about Mysterious. It. Mm. Something I can't quite define. Yeah, right? I guess I like it. The truth is I have nothing left to say anymore. Each day that goes by brings me closer to the end. I'm just an old man clinging to his brushes. Carl. But enough about me. Let's see if you have any talent. All right, here we go. Give it a try. I'm oozing with talent. Something. Give me that brush. Paint? But would I... Painting what? Anything you want. Give it a try. <sighs> just be confident. Be confident in the strokes. 
All right, give me this thing. Let's go. Time to put in that work. Find a subject to paint. Uh, paint statue, paint desk. I want to paint Carl. He's my love. Wait, we're going to paint Carl's painting? Okay, let's try it. Let's see if we can recreate that. Because maybe he'll see it in a different way, you know? I want to see what's going through his mind. Already? No that freaking is a way! copy of reality. But painting is not about replicating the world. It's about interpreting, improving on it. Showing something you see. Carl, I don't... I think I can do that. It's not in my program. I... Go on, go. Try it. Grab that canvas. Do something for me. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Okay, I'll close my eyes. Trust me. I trust you. What do I do now? Oh, I actually have to open my eyes so I can see the game. <laughs> Try to imagine something that doesn't exist, something you've never seen. Now concentrate. Okay. On how it makes you feel. And let your hand drift across the canvas. All right, Carl. Here we go. Androids, humanity, identity. I want to see what he thinks of his identity. Androids, despair, doubts, prisoner. Yeah, I feel like he feels like he's a prisoner. So let's do this. Oh, this is gonna be a masterpiece. You know when the eyes are closed, it's real. It's the real deal. Oh, smooth strokes. Perfecciones. Look at that. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, look at the stroke game. Yeah, baby, I'm gonna close my eyes. Let's do this. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. I know. Oh, my God, indeed. Who the hell is this guy? Hey, Dad. Leo. I didn't hear you come in. Oh, I was in the neighborhood. I thought I'd stop by. It's been a while, right? You all right? You don't look so good. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> hey, listen, uh, I need some cash, Dad. Of course you do. Again? He dresses what like he needs some cash from his dad. You? Uh, well, it just goes, you know? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you're on it again, aren't you? No, 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 I swear it's not that. No, uh, don't lie to me, Leo. What difference does it make? I just need some cash, that's all. Sorry. The answer is no. Ooh. What? Why? He put his you foot down. You know why. Yeah, yeah, I think I do know why. <laughs> you'd, rather, you'd rather take care of your uh, plastic toy here than your own son, right? Tell me, Dad, what's, what's it got that I don't? Smarter? More obedient? Not like me, right? But you know what? This thing is not your son. It's a fucking machine! Leo, that's enough. Enough. You don't care about anything except yourself and your goddamn paintings. You've never loved anyone. You never loved me, Dad. You never loved me. Well then. Damn. Both of those chapters were really good. I don't want to stop. 56% complete? What? No. I could have sworn I did everything that I needed to do. That's insane, guys. But even though I want to play so much more right now, I'm going to have to end this episode here. 
If you want me to upload another episode as soon as possible, guys, make sure you give this video one big fat like. And tell a friend today that Jay from the Cub Scouts is the dude! <laughs>